Hello and welcome to the Information Technology Programme, part three of our series on multimedia in the construction and property industries. In earlier programmes, we looked at the internet, World Wide Web, video conferencing and virtual reality. In this programme, we move on a step further to look at how this technology is being utilised in the property world on three very different research projects. Project one is KIC. A pilot scheme is running at the Blue Water Retail Development in Kent, where a complex collaborative working system is being utilised. Project two is MIC. It's centred on the use of mobile communications products on construction sites. And project three, Resolve, is developing a way of building 3D CAD models of interiors using a robot which controls a laser rangefinder and a digital camera. KIC and Resolve are being led by BICC, the parent company of Balfour Beatty, and MIC by Bouygues, the major French contractor. It's all been funded by the European Commission under the Advanced Communications Technologies and Services Programme, known as ACTS. And with us again is our regular contributor, Mark Wilderspin of Innova Communications, and joining him is David Levers of BICC PLC. Welcome to both of you to the studio. Now, um, if I can turn to you first, Mark, before we look at these three projects in uh, more detail, what are the key technology advancements that are making them possible? Well, basically, David, uh, we're, we're looking at three projects in this programme which uh, all rely to a certain extent on uh, communication networks, um, including intranet, uh, intranets, uh, the World Wide Web, um, local and wide area networks and, and mobile networks. And as we progress uh, towards more broadband capabilities in relation to high capacities and high speeds, uh, this is enabling the type of technology applications we're looking at further today, uh, such as 3D graphics, video conferencing, uh, augmented virtual reality and, and online databases, to become more feasible and, and more commonplace in, within the industry. Uh -huh. Now, David, what's the ACTS program all about then? Well, it's a, a European Commission program, and the main objective is to encourage European researchers to work together on new communications technologies. Uh, the end result in uh, our three uh, projects is that the construction industry itself starts to work together better. Mm -hmm. So, in general terms, put this to both of you, what are you trying to achieve with these projects? Um, well, overall, we're trying to strengthen the feeling of being one member of a very large team that might be distributed across many different locations, and that's requiring an increasing use of different visual technologies, uh, together with uh, the networking of those uh, images uh, across the many PCs that are involved. Mm -hmm. And Mark? Well, I think, as David said, one of the key issues is all about collaboration. And, and using technology in these projects is, 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 a, is a very nice way of, of, of actually helping to achieve industry strategic objectives such as those arising in the Latham um, in terms of using communications to the greater extent for collaborate, collaborating within project teams, uh, improving efficiency and the quality, reducing costs and certainly uh, giving greater emphasis to client focus. Mm -hmm. well, thanks for the moment. Well now let's start with a more detailed look at KIC.